So I want to know if I win, if I was running, and I won a quarter of the votes in 36, not even, not even 24, in all 36 states, but I failed to win a quarter of the votes in uh, the FCT, would I be declared president? I've taken 36 states, or, in fact, 36 states, I take 100% of the votes. That's more than a quarter. But I do not make one quarter in Abuja. Would I be declared president? My view is no. But because of the confusion and the way that the 12, uh, 13, uh, 9, 19 to 13 came up, nobody ever gave a thought that Kano State could be divided. Because a, a human being, a state is like a, a being. You can't split it. But the Supreme Court split Kano State. So I rather would like to promote the view that INEC must be prepared for all eventualities. Meanwhile, Chief Wole Olanik Bekun is calling on the National Assembly to consider changing Section 65 of the Electoral Act, saying it poses serious danger to peaceful elections. During a chat with journalists after a courtesy visit to the governor of Ekiti State, the senior advocate faulted the allowance provided by the section for a returning officer to review and possibly reverse within seven days decision taken to return a candidate. The returning officer is a, not a cut of law. The returning officer is not a tribunal. The returning officer is not vested with jurisdiction to exercise judicial or quasi judicial uh, decision or to assume jurisdiction over any matter that is judicial in nature. When election is conducted, the returning officer returns or makes a return. Immediately thereafter, depending on the number of days, any agreed party goes to court, not to determine, I mean, not go back to the, to the returning officer that has made a return. By that section, you are given a returning officer and by extension INEC to do and not do. 